grace, grace to you, good people over the world. Um, Colossians chapter 3, verses 14, on your bread of life today. And the title for your bread is, Put on Love. Yes, put on love. And I'm going to read the New King James. The Bible says, but above all these things, put on love which is the bond of perfection so love is defined as the bond of perfection so allow me to say that love is the true incense of christianity it's the true incense blessed are the pure in heart for they shall see god and God rewards us according to the state of our heart. So this love is a true instance of Christianity. Love is like clothes that go over all your other clothes. You understand? Those guys, you know, when we're growing up, we used to have those Christmas clothes. And they were so special. They were above all other clothes. We loved them so much. You understand? So that's the instance. That's the definition of love. Okay, so love is important that it gives okay for god so loved the world that he gave his son christ so loved us that he gave his life so true love gives true love gives it's very important we understand that so love is more important than anything else it makes everything like our ministries or relationships complete as they should be Imagine a husband and wife loving each other. It makes them complete as they should be. There's got, there has to be that love, that bond of perfection. Paul says in 1 Corinthians chapter 13, chapter 13, 1 to 3, he says, Though I speak with the tongues of men and of angels, but I have not love, I have become sounding brass or a clagging symbol. And though I have the gift of prophecy and understand all mysteries, and all knowledge and though i have all faith so that i could remove mountains but have not love i am nothing paul is very critical about this thing called love i don't care how much mysteries you proclaim and speak if you don't have love it is all nothing i don't care how much i share your bread of life if there is no love it is nothing i can spend the whole day every seek every day 365 days a year, a year and give your bread of life without love that is nothing so it's very important for you to understand that and it says and though i bestow all my goods to feed the poor and though i give my body to be burnt but i have not love it profits me nothing so love is a cladding symbol okay i am nothing without it i am nothing and without it, it profits me nothing. So let love, my friends, be the upper garment. You understand? That, that mark of our dignity and distinction. Okay? This holds everything and everybody together. It makes us complete. It makes husband and wife complete. It makes our ministry complete. It makes a family complete. It makes the nation complete. It makes everything complete it's very important so the golden nugget is love holds everything and everybody together you husband check on your marriage you parent check on your love for your children you children check on your love for your parents this love holds everything and everybody together that's why it is important you are compelled by the love of christ so pray with me loving father I thank you for your love that you have bestowed upon me. This love has cast out all fear and anxiety in my life. I am no longer slave to fear. I know that I'm your child. I'm secured in the Father's love. It's your love for me and in me that I know God is with me and in me and in everything that I do. This is the love that has turned me into more than a conqueror. In Jesus' mighty name and everybody said, Amen and amen and amen. When you put in love, I'll guarantee one thing, that the best is yet to come. And God bless you.